It's what happens when you mix one part crates with two parts cowabunga. What's inside the Loot Crate Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles subscription box? While I have had a look at Loot Crate subscription boxes in the past, these new Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle ones have caught my attention. Because not only are you going to be getting TMNT merchandise inside these black boxes, but as a collaboration between Loot Crate and NECA Toys, you also get inside an exclusive, nowhere else to be found, TMNT NECA figure. We're going to go ahead and open up the box, and if you'd like to get on board and subscribe to Loot Crate, you can click the link down below in the video description. I did notice, though, that the new TMNT box from Loot Crate did take a while, it seemed, to finally arrive at my doorstep. Nonetheless, though, we're going to go ahead and open up the box, check out the contents, and I'll show you exactly which exclusive figure you would have found inside this one. Now, of course, in order to do that, I'm going to have to cut the tape that's on the front of the box. I'm going to grab old red for this, and we're going to spin this around just so I can get access to the tape, cut the seal that's on the front. Now, let's go ahead and open up and check out the contents. Now, one thing already, presentation-wise, I have to award it for Loot Crate for giving us a very colorful interior of the box. And you can probably already see the exclusive figure that's going to be contained inside. But before we actually get to that, let's first have a look at the other contents inside. First of all, we got ourselves a t-shirt, a very bright neon. Would you consider that green or yellow? I probably would say that's like a, a yellow highlighter color. And it does have, as you can see, the four Turtle Brothers peeking their their heads, their eyes out from the manhole cover from the original 1990 poster. And you have the original po the original poster font, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles up at the top corner there. Flip it around to the back. On the back, you have also Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. And actually, in actual fact, it's not a t-shirt. It's a long-sleeved shirt. So not only are people going to be able to spot you on the street walking by, but it's also going to keep you nice and warm as well. Let's see what else we have in here. Contained inside as well, it looks like we got ourselves a couple of coasters. Now, instead of being from the 1990 movie, this is actually based from the original comic run. I love the darker coloring of the turtles presented here. And it looks like you do get ourselves two coasters. Don't even have to open this up to show you the both sides of them. One side, you have the four turtles. And then, of course, flipped around to the other side, the evil shred head. They seem like they're softer, rubbery... Uh, coasters as well. So not those hard coasters with usually the cork bottom to it. Seems like they're slightly a little bit more rubberier. So that's always good as well. Good for drinks and of course resting your beverages. Seems like we also got ourselves a couple of collector's pins. One of Raphael, one of Casey Jones. I think that's a good pairing to have the two of them together like this. And again, it looks like they're very nice looking painted pins. And luckily they did actually put two backings for each of the pins. So at least they're not going to fall off your jacket. That's pretty cool. I think my favorite, though, of the two is the Casey Jones. Raphael's not bad, but I think I really like the look of that Casey Jones. I'm going to add that to my denim jacket. The last thing inside, just before we get to the actual exclusive figure, there's an insert card. I guess really we could look at the insert card last because it's only simply going to show you the other characters, the other things that would have been packaged in the in the box. We've already done that. So for the exclusive figure in this in this loot crate, we have the TMNT Danny Pennington. Again, it's a loot crate exclusive. I don't think a lot of the times these figures ever see light of day outside of having being inside a loot crate box because again, it's a co collaboration between loot crate and NECA toys. So if you did want to get your hands on Danny Pennington, you would have had to have subscribed to loot crate. Seems like he does have two swappable head sculpts, one with the bandana, one without it comes with his Walkman. It would have been nice if he came with like a, a Burger King box of fries. I think he's actually eating that while he's looking at all the things he looted for the day. Of course, it shows you here him on the back along with Casey Jones, along with Splinter. Doesn't actually show you a picture of him with Shredder. And then you've got the read up down below as well with the four Turtle Brothers. A separate review of Danny will be coming up shortly on this channel. So keep your peepers peeled for that. And then, of course, we've got ourselves the insert card, which is basically just listing all the, all the stuff we just had to look at. Join the Turtles on the big screen with this blockbuster-worthy celebration in the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles movie crate. And then, of course, flip it around to the back. gives you a better idea of what we got here. The exclusive Danny Pennington figure with accessories also got in, included inside. An exclusive Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles long-sleeved shirt. 
Although uh, it's not as bright on the card that it is in actual fact. I mean, it, it, it's glowing. It's burning my rods and cones as we speak. A coaster set, a couple of nice rubber coasters, and a Casey and Raphael pin set. All of which, again, all the four items, including the Danny Pennington, are exclusives to Loot Crate. So the only way you can actually get them is subscribing to Loot Crate. If uh, speaking of which, if you guys certainly would like to subscribe to Loot Crate, specifically the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle movie tie-in boxes, where again you can get those exclusive NECA figures that you can't get anywhere else, you can click the link down below in the video description that will take you on over to Loot Crate's website. From there, you can subscribe and get specifically, if you like to, get on board those TMNT crates. They usually sell out pretty fast because again, you're going to be getting exclusive figures that you can't find anywhere else. If you guys are new to this channel and you're enjoying all the content you're seeing, make sure you hit that subscribe button down below, turn the bell notification on, and keep your peepers peeled, because while we have finished the unboxing of Loot Crate, the review of the, the Danny Pennington NECA exclusive Loot Crate figure will be coming your way in the not-so-distant future. As always, guys, thanks for watching. See you guys next time.